I want to introduce you to Miss Tallulah May Grace. We're going to call her Tay Tay. Is she not a doll? Keep her to herself. She is tiny. She is a long haired teacup chi. And she has the most beautiful eyes. Yes, she does. I just wanted to introduce y'all to her. We just got her yesterday. Say hi to Lula. Say hi, Tay Tay. Well, see, that's the closest we're going to get with the ears. <laughs> okay, good morning again. I am headed to Athens. Y'all have met Miss Tallulah Tay Tay. And we got her so late yesterday afternoon. We didn't go get her. I need to go get her some blankets and a sweater. And I got to pick up a couple other things. And I know I look bad. There's a reason why I look bad. Because I do. Because I didn't put a makeup on. Didn't take time. So anyway, I'm headed to the store. And plus, to mail off the rest of my Christmas cards. I got some of them mailed off Saturday because I had enough stamps already. So here we go. So did y'all have a good weekend? I had a good weekend. We had a relaxing weekend and then of course we had a great weekend when we found Tallulah or Tay Tay as I call her. Keith calls her Tallulah which I named her and Keith's calling her Tallulah because he says it sounds Hawaiian and I don't know how I came up with that name but <laughs> Tallulah May but I call her Tay Tay. And she is so adorable. She's so tiny. And ah, oh, she's, she's, I mean, ah, oh, so tiny. And we, when we went to get her yesterday, I made sure I wore short sleeves so I could hold her to make sure I wasn't going to break out because she is a long coat chihuahua. Missy that we had, she was a short coat chihuahua. So I wanted to make sure that before we brought her home, <laughs> I wouldn't be allergic to her. So anyway, so I held her for a while. I never broke out. So I was like, ah. And uh, I just fell in love with her. And we went, we went yesterday with the intent. We was not going to get a puppy. We were just going to look. Because we were going to see some other puppies that were coming in this next weekend. That was a Maltapoos. Or no, no, no. A Pinkapoos or something. I don't know. Anyway. But we, we seen her and we fell in love. She is so laid back. She, she had, I don't think I've even heard her bark. And she's nine. Born September the 27th, the day after Keith's birthday. So, uh, so she is such a doll, and uh, it's I got like I said, going shopping for my baby. <laughs> it's done turned all chilly here in East Texas. I'm glad I got a seat warmer. Cause whoo, it was cold when I got in here. Dollar Tree haul for us. I really didn't get that much in there. So I just included it in today. I went ahead and got a tree topper for our new little LED uh, tree. That way I don't have to dig out all those other uh, ornaments and stuff that we have at the house. I got this Silver Bell garland. thought that would go cute on that little LED tree. And these ball garlands. And a tree skirt to go around it because it's on top of my uh, printer and stove and, and like a heater, uh, looks like a fireplace heater. So I'm gonna put that around that. And then I can't show you the rest, it's just some stuff for a bag from one of my granddaughters. So, but that's a seat, that's all I got there. Now to Walmart to see if they have blankets. I was sure hoping they would have some baby blankets in there, but they didn't. So now on to Walmart, and if Walmart don't have the blankets I'm looking for, I'll go to Dollar General. I went ahead and parked up here by the garden center. We're going this way. That way I don't have to fight out and walk 10 miles to the door. Santa Claus is here. Yep, guys, that's what it's doing. So I'm not going to talk on the way home. I'm leaving Walmart. Well, me and Tay Tay. And Keith finally got the little tree up with the little ornaments. This is what we got in today from my daughter in Georgia. 
to his best grandparents. <laughs> so they're not gonna be able to make it in for Christmas, but but we'll have that ornament to, <laughs> to think on with. And I got this is what uh, y'all see me hold at Dollar Tree, just some silver bells and some little balls. And so that is our setup for this year. I know it may not be a lot to because I know a lot of people go, I just, this just suits me fine. We don't, uh, I don't, it just, it's just perfect for me. <laughs> so anyway, and there's the star. Okay, y'all, it's time to end this day. If it's head to bed, thought I'd go over the day with you. Uh, as y'all went with me, we went and got groceries. I did call to refill my meds, but they never even came back to said they had them done until I was almost back home. So I'll have to go back and get them later this week. I did do some shopping for Tay Tay. Yes, I had to get, I ended up getting, uh, I'll have to show you tomorrow. Uh, cause she's in, is in bed with her right now, but I ended up getting some material because it was cheaper than buying baby receiving blankets or anything else. And it is so cute. I can't wait. I, I wish I would have showed it to you earlier, but I'll show it to you tomorrow. And of course, Keith's is having to work. And today on YouTube, I had my wins from uh, Jenny girl 0204. And tonight we had tomato soup with macaroni and cheese. I know, don't knock it till you try. <laughs> and, of course, I did get dressed, and I did leave the house today. No makeup, but I did get dressed. Oh, I forgot to mark off. I did take my medicine. Did I almost forgot it, but I did take it. And so I'll mark that off when I get off of here. And I hope y'all have, have had a good day, and y'all have a good night. So, good night. Sleep tight. Don't let them bed bugs bite. Well, me and Tay Tay just sit here waiting for Lynn and Jennifer and Maddie and Kenzie and Joshua to get here. Well, I am poor Tay Tay. Poor Tay Tay had never been around all these kids, so we're going to have to... <laughs> Ooh, bless your heart. But they're going to love you. And... Oh, I got a fan in front of the tree, but there's the tree from there. Sit here watching Little House on the Prairie. And plus, watching some YouTube. So that's what, how it's been. I got the living room straightened up today. And kitchen cleaned up. Some la Oh, I gotta put some little laundry in the dryer. So I'll be back. I wanted to show you, I got another Christmas card in the mail that Tay Tay's trying to take. Of a little girl with the dog. She must like the little dog. It's from Marcy. For Marcy, uh, well, she uh, she changed her channel name up, but Marcy Smith. And oh my gosh, Marcy is beautiful. And thank you so much. Thank you also for be, always being so supportive of my channel. And I love this card. Well, down oh. here, there's Mr. <laughs> Joshua, Kenzie, Jennifer, Maddie, Erica, and there's Tay Tay. Okay, guys, it has come to the evening time. Pissing the head to bed. I'm going to go over my schedule today. Uh, let's see here. I did get dressed. I got me a long hot bath, which felt wonderful. I did get to talk to Sarah today on the phone. I got to talk to a high school friend, Leanne, from the phone. I also talked to the uh, kennel that we got Tay-Tay from today. And we're uh, getting registration done for her. I did have a YouTube video up today. Lynn and Jennifer and the kids came for supper. We had shrimp creole, which was so much fun. I did do some editing today and some uploading of some videos today. Keith had to work, has to work tonight. And like I already had said, I've tried to register Tay Tay today. I'm running some issues with that. It was computer issues. And I received an Etsy order in today, and I received an eBay order in today that y'all see a haul coming. I did some laundry. I uh, did some, I cleaned the kitchen up, uh, watched some inspiration channel, watched some YouTube videos, and played with Tay Tay. And that has been uh, more or less my day. It's been a good day. And I hope y'all have had a good day, and I will see you tomorrow. Good night. 
Good morning. Happy Wednesday morning. Me and Miss Tay Tay wanted to say good morning. Can you say good morning, Tay Tay? Can you say good morning? She has been such a joy, y'all. She is such a good puppy. This morning was the first time since we had her. I heard her yelp. And it's like, what was that? <laughs> she, she's so tiny. Let me see here. She's so tiny. But she is a doll. Yes, she is. And Mama got to go to the doctor today. Yes, I call her. I call myself Mama to her. He calls himself Daddy. Uh, yep, I know. But that's okay. But Mama's got to go to the doctor this morning and stuff. So I just wanted to say good morning. And I'll see y'all in a little while. Okay, y'all. First, I head to Palestine to the doctor. Hadn't been to the counselor in a few weeks because this is a new my first spot with a new one because my old one left she moved so this will be interesting and i know my hair is wild i forgot and didn't get a shower until late last night and washed it and i hadn't went to bed with it kind of wet so it kind of poofy <laughs> so anyway let's head out boy i am trying my best to think about what i want to get for supper tonight and i don't know which is only 9 30 in the morning so it ain't like it's i gotta think well i gotta think before i leave town because i didn't lay anything out so i'm not for sure what i'm going to get but see y'all give me some ideas tell me what i need to get for supper tonight y'all tell me in cold weather if y'all ever had this happen i had left my sunglasses out in the car so uh so it was cold they were cold so when I went to put them on a while ago because the sun came out, they fogged up. <laughs> I hate when that happens, but it's funny. But anyway, have y'all had that happen to you before? I want to ask a question because this is just, it is happening right now. Does anybody else that suffer with the chronic fatigue or even like the uh, fibromyalgia or whatever, as y'all seen, I was wide awake not five minutes ago and I wasn't tired and as I am driving my eyes get so heavy and all of a sudden and I get so tired I have it literally takes everything in me right now to fight to keep my eyes open and it scares me because I switched out. I don't like driving long distance anymore because I mean it just comes on and the reason why I came over here to talk to y'all is maybe to wake me and make sure I stay away. But I hate it. And I, that's that's the part of it that I hate. It's just like, because there's so much I want to do. There's so many things I want to craft and to make and, and do. But then, when I want to go do it, I get so, I, I have no energy. I've and this happens. And it makes me so that it happens because it is scary most especially when uh, when you're driving and so and that's one reason I guess it's a good thing that you know God led me to start vlogging because I do feel a little bit more awake just talking to y'all so I so anyway I just wonder does this, does this happen to anybody else that you can be fine and then wish all of a sudden you're so tired you feel like you have worked all day stayed up all night worked the next day and your eyes are so it's so hard to hold open that you have to fight to keep them open i was just wondering if i'm the only one or if y'all have that same issue to have this problem okay finished with the doctor's appointment now i need to go to hobby lobby to pick up something and also I need to go to Petco to pick up see if I can find a sweater for Tay Tay I can't uh, she's so small the Walmart and Athens the only extra small they had was like a coat thing and I want something she can wear comfortably around the house had to come by the Sonic of course before I go to my to the Hobby Lobby and to PetSmart and then probably Dollar Tree Okay, finished at Hobby Lobby. I did get more than one thing, but I didn't get a whole lot. Not like I usually would do. I did control myself. So, anyway, just a second, and let me pull over, and I'll show you what I got right now. Okay, it wasn't a whole lot, like I said. 
I got me, I lear uh, learned about this from Mae Larson. She uses one of these trees that you get in the Christmas section right now to do her chunky charms on. It's high enough that they'll hang down. Because one I got, the day that I got, it doesn't work. It doesn't work for chunky charms. It's not, it's not tall enough. Then on clearance, I found this thread, which I thought would be good to make tassels with. On clearance, I found these be pretty pink and rhinestone beads. On clearance, I found this trim, 60 cents. I thought would be good to make tassels with. I got me some more 22 gauge uh, wire. And one thing I can't show you, and I got this, this little thing, I thought it was so cute. And it is, oh, this is my best friend, some, some of my best friends are flakes. Oh, I thought that would be good. <laughs> so anyway, so that's all I got at Hobby Dobby. So now headed on to Pet Smart. Okay y'all, call me silly, but I just got a text from JC Penney's that I can get $10 off of $25. Me and Keith, not long ago, I think I showed y'all, I ordered some towels from them. Oh my gosh. We never, I haven't bought new towels in I don't know how many years. <laughs> That's sad, I know, but I haven't. And I'm just going to go in here and get us uh, a few, however many towels I can get for $25, and then they'll take $10 off, and then I'll only have to pay $15. So, yes. And I'm going into the back of the mall. This is the actual mall. This is the Mall of Palestine. So, <laughs> it's not that big of a mall, trust me. JCPenney's, I think, is only, actually about the only store that's in here. I, but the medical office is that the billing office I used to work for used to be. It used to be right here where we had to park to, uh, to go into the back door to where we worked at. Ugh, brings back nightmares. I might not should have pulled back here. But I'm going to pull up here and go in real quick. And see what like, damage I can do. Hopefully not much. <laughs> okay guys. I kept on pulling inside JC Penney's. I went in and went because I was reason I went in this back door because I knew where the towels were. And I got two blue and two of these dark gray looking i thought they'd be pretty and oh their towels their towels are amazing and i ended up getting they were on sale for eight dollars regular 17 and then i got ten dollars off so i didn't want to spend paying 23 dollars for them instead of 47 dollars which they would have been so hot dog i'm happy but i am serious y'all i if y'all see my towels y'all would laugh and if y'all knew how old some of them are y'all would even laugh even harder because i just never had we just we oh my gosh we didn't throw away <laughs> some of them until at, then we made hand towels out of them when they got so many holes in them and now we've got some pretty good ones but that's those are the first towels well that and the two that i bought like i said a few months ago is the first towels that i have bought and i don't know how long it's like that the ones that we have that's big and kind of good those are the body towels and then i have the stack of all the old ones that has like holes in it that's my hair towels <laughs> so, I think it's it was time and and lord have you looked at walmart lately for the price of their towels unless you get those little bitty what they call what they say is towels what i call hand towels uh, and they're like five and six dollars i'm going my gosh and like i said i just got those towels that's extra large very very soft oh amazing for uh, eight dollars on sale so a piece well then then half that price so might as well say uh well not half maybe third so might as well say for same price as anyway as walmart's towels little towels are so now 
headed to PetSmart and Dollar Tree. I'm gonna find something in Dollar Tree for supper tonight. I'm sorry, it's not PetSmart. Here is PetSense. So, anyway, that's where I'm going. And then into the Dollar Tree. And it looks like the Dollar Tree is crowded. I'll just park right here. That way I ain't gotta bite anybody. Some of these people, they're crazy. I'm telling you, they'll push you plum out of the way. Yep, they sure will. I told y'all that place was crazy. Whoa, baby. They didn't even have any uh, buggies. I had to get a buggy from an old lady. And, it, and I had to lean it on one side to be able to get it to work. But I'll... Sh and I just got some food. I have nothing... Nothing to chalk one sleep anyway. There was nothing new. Well, trust me. But I want to show you the sweater that I got Tay-Tay. Look at the sweater. Is that not burning? <laughs> I love it. And it's even got a little toboggan. <laughs> so she sat and got her some of her doggy food, her puppy food. So now headed home. Oh yeah, I forgot. I told y'all that I was going to figure out something for supper in there. And I did. It ain't the healthiest thing, but oh well. <sighs> Until into the new year. I try to be good when I can, but like today, mm -mm. I found two of those, kind of like the Mac Rib sandwiches at McDonald's. I found those, and I've heard so many people say they're really good from the Dollar Tree. So I got a couple of those, and I got a couple of their little personal Supreme pieces in case Keith doesn't want that. And so that's what we're gonna have for supper today. And I'm gonna, I got some Northern beans, dry Northern beans at the house, and I'm gonna put them on to soak tonight, and I'm gonna cook those tomorrow. That's what we'll have tomorrow night. Hey, they put them speed bumps tall enough for me. Whew. Lord, you had you can, don't even can't even be going. Just have to kind of ease over. <laughs> God love this Texas weather. Y'all know when I was headed up here, I was freezing. Had the uh, seat warmer on. Had the heat on. Now it's warm. Got the air on. Tell me. Got to love living in Texas. Okay, y'all, it's come to the night time again, so we can kind of go over today. Uh, I was going to do work on a chunky charm. I didn't get to that, but I did design some stickers in Cricut Design Space. I designed some for, uh, uh, for, for Tallulah or Tay-Tay for when I'm doing something for her. And I designed a hair wash sticker because I noticed I didn't have one of those. So I did do that. And I, for some reason, I guess it's the cold weather that's come in. I have had a very painful <laughs> evening. And I had my doctor's appointment this morning. Y'all came along with me with that. And I received uh, an, an my Amazon order that where I had ordered uh, Tate her kennel and feeding bowls. And I also uh, got in some of the Christmas items that I had bought for my grandch uh, uh, grandchildren. And I got in an order from Christian Bookstore. And let's see here. Oh, and I got a Tay Tay uh, Tallulah registered today. She's officially with AKC uh, Tallulah May Grays. And I've watched some Inspiration Channel, of course, as I usually always do, and some YouTube videos. On YouTube today, I had the antique shopping where I went with, went, met up with Miss Shonda in Canton. And where we had a good time. And today in Palestine, you came along with me when I went to Hobby Lobby, JCPenney, PetSense, and uh, Dollar Tree. And uh, I did a little bit of Amazon shopping this evening to get her some dresses. The sweater that I bought her at PetSense is too big right now, so she'll have to grow into it. Tonight for dinner, it was just a fan for yourself <laughs> of what I got at the Dollar Tree. I did, though, get dressed. I put the makeup on, and, of course, I did go out. And, and let's see here. Uh, oh, this morning, Tallulah uh, actually woke me up for the first time barking. We have not heard her bark since we got her Sunday. Well, she's, she did her bark this morning. It's a funny-sounding little bark, but she did. So that was my Wednesday, and I hope you all enjoyed it. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Good morning, guys. Yes, I don't think I even 
said get good morning yesterday or good night yesterday i can officially use the sticker it was a lazy day i was my fatigue was uh was was horrible and i was just i had a headache just was just tired so i slept most of the day i did only thing i actually did i think was do our checkbook uh, we watched some Disney and Inspiration, of course, and, some, and I watched some YouTube videos. Uh, Keith, bless his heart, he did go to town for me, pick up my prescriptions that I had ready to pick up. He checked our mail and picked up what little groceries and stuff that we needed. And uh, yesterday, I believe it was, I think it was like the... Uh, I don't remember what we had yesterday. I put that down there, but I didn't really check that for a tech because I think that's what's up today. I don't think I had a video yesterday. I think that's what it was. I got that on the wrong thing. So today is the one that with the Dollar Tree and Walmart and more hauls it is today. And for uh, supper, I did put some pork chops in the oven and boil some potatoes. So that's what Keith had for supper. And today now, I have... Uh, I have the dollars, like I said, the Dollar Tree, Walmart, and other haul on today's channel. I need to do my planner today. I got some kitchen to clean up and do some laundry. So today should be a pretty busy day. First, though, I am going to get this. Uh, I do have some, I think, have some good footage for y'all this week. So I am going to get this edited and going up uh, since my internet's so bad. And I will see y'all next week. Thank you for joining me my, with for Saturday Snaps. And love you guys. Bye.